This is Trisha Lynn, and it is too early for streaming uh, today on Sunday. And this is an important date because it's Sunday, September 23rd, and it's the very, very last day for everyone who has been in the NTG Arena closed beta to play the games and get some experience and spend all their um, in-game currency before it gets all refunded to us the the amount the stuff we paid for not the stuff that we've earned um basically all the all the in-game currency we've paid for will get refunded to us and then we can play with everybody else in the open beta it starts on sunday on uh, the 27th which is a thursday so in four days ntg arena will be out of closed beta and into open beta and everyone will be able to play and I have decided to clear out my cache of uh, stuff in terms of uh, um, clear out, like, I, I have approximately 14,000 in the gold and 1,000 in the um, gems. And so I thought I might as well just clear out, clear everything out, do my final bits of uh, quest earning and uh see how far i can go so we're not going to be focusing on uh decks like i normally do so i think i'll probably just close turn this off and we're just going to go ahead and do a whole bunch of free play maybe some drafts we'll see we'll see how this goes um and let's just see how far i can go so i think the first thing i want to do is start with the format known as Momir. And Momir is a format where uh, you start with a Vanguard card. And the Vanguard card is something that is always on the board. It never goes away. It's like a it's like an emblem where in that it, it it affects your board state and only yours. Um, except the other person you're playing has a Vanguard too. And this would go through and uh, choose any card that is available in standard and it makes a copy of it, but it's a random card. So you never know what you're going to get. I have not done very well in this format at all, but we've got money. So let's go ahead and start and uh, use some of it. <clears throat> and apparently there's a lot of strategy that, that goes on in uh, Mobir that I don't know too much about. This is probably the reason why I've been losing a lot. So let's just see how we go. Oh, okay. So you start with a group of seven lands, and I'm going first. And the first thing you do is you play a land, and then you tap the land to activate the factory from Amir Vig, where you discard a card and create a token that has the same kind of mana cost. So we're going to go ahead and do that. And I'm going to discard this mountain because have extras and we always want to make sure we have domain. Now the thing that I've got out is Merchant Stockhand. It's a token artifact creature. I've never seen this card before. This is from Calpinesh. Aetherable. Aetherable I think. Tap unchecked artifacts. Blah blah blah. Look at the top. Like all this stuff completely useless to me because my library is basically lands. <clears throat> So this is not a great card to have as your first uh, creature on the battlefield. Oh, they have a much better one. Oh no, they have... Oh great, now they have card advantage over me. Oh wait, yeah, uh, let's get out. I don't have an island down here, so I have an island. Yeah, now I have card advantage over that. Nice. Um, all right, let's play this uh, for 
this good. And now I can tap all three to play on a three to uh, a three or a three CMC feature. Yeah. Four cards you can have on. I do discard two cards. Let's do that. Why not? And then I'm going to discard this mountain because it's an extra. And I'll discard uh, this island because it was also an extra. And then I can't attack because we're going to be on the floor. <clears throat> this is nice. From Hour of Devastation. I've never played with this card before. Neither, not either in Paper Magic or in Regular Magic because they don't have a lot of... I was actually just going through my Paper Magic collection recently and I do not have a lot of rares. Not this one's really good. Oh great, they have a flying creature. Great. Just great. Beautiful. Mm -mm. Okay, let's play out this plane. And we'll tap the four. And we'll discard the forest. And I don't want to attack because this can block, but it will. Hmm. This gets eternalized. This is a dead card to me. This could eventually come back. Might as well attack. Why not? I don't. It's again. This is all play money anyway. So why not? Why the heck not? Cool. So I got a territorial allosaurus. Yay! That's a that's a five toughness creature. That's awesome. Again, I'm seeing a lot of cards I've never seen before because A, they bring these up at random, and B, I have not paid for a lot of rares in arena. <clears throat> You could probably cut the block by two or less. Okay. So let's play out the swamp. Now we've got their main. Huh. I could find out a way to get more things out there. Hmm. Huh. Let us. I guess that didn't work the way I wanted it to. Okay, they could do, uh, this person could double block and kill that, but then I'd end up getting what, rid of one of theirs as well. Uh, why not? Probably, again, I have never done great in this format, so I'm probably going to lose. Yep. It's a good old double block. But let's put that one first so that they won't be able to activate that. Oh, good. Two trades. Two rank for trades. So now, of course, they're going to be able to swing back. That's a flyer. That's fine. Everything is fine. But at least I got. I have card advantage over that, which is good. Next turn, I can tap for six. Oh no! Oh no! That's a great card to have. Again, runes! What the heck is up with all these runes? Uh, let's get out. I like double white. No, double green. We want double green. And of course, this uh, Momir only gets creatures. Yep. 
If it also got instants and sorceries, that would be kind of weird. Uh, no, this is not... Uh, hi, Bianchi. How are, where, how are you doing? This game is not going to substitute MitGo. This game is actually in addition to MitGo. Um, it kind of takes the place of Duels of Planeswalkers or the other um, free-to-play forms of magic. Um, the Right now, this is a, it's also only in the standard format, unlike um, MitGo, which also has you know other drafts and whatnot. Oh, why would Dawn bring her? Not good. Not good at all. Let's get some more green out here. And let's get a play seven drop. Hold on. Yeah, no no no. No, you don't have to worry at all. This is not gonna this is not gonna make it go away. Um that has first strike, which isn't gonna do anything against this creature. This also goes in, but it can't do anything. But I did gain life, which is awesome. Not gonna attack. Doesn't make sense to attack right now. Um, are you a bit, you know, the other, the one thing I don't like about NTG Arena is that you can't play against your friends. You play against random opponents all the time. Um, for example, this opponent is KBL9J. I have no idea, I don't know anything about them, and I can't talk to them either because they only give us these emotes to talk with. And apparently, you can be really crazy with these emotes. That was a bit of good luck if they got a, uh, let's see if I can get a, get a, get a, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Are there any 8 drop creatures? Let's find out. <laughs> nice. Nice! Alright, so now I've got a 5-5. Five, five. They've got a 7-6. Ugh. Not, this is still not good. I can't attack without... I can't attack and have to make profitable blocks. Nope. This is terrible. Everything is terrible. Then they're gonna attack with their flyers next turn. Oh, this is interesting. Hmm. Maybe I should attack with this next turn. If I was gonna attack, I'd attack with this. Oh, another creature. Okay, I can't let that one go. This one, I could probably get rid of. Uh... Now I can't discard, I can't tap this land, I can't play this land, because if I play that land, then I'm not going to be able to, to activate Romir. Romir. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, yep. Eight, eight. Yeah! Love it. Let us attack with this. Um, I can attack with this. Um, I want to check with that. And, yep. <clears throat> yep. But I'm gonna get another one! <laughs> yeah! Look at that! Look at that! I'm just gonna keep attacking with this. Because every time I die, I get five life! Yeah! Oh, this is great. This is fantastic. I'm glad I kept. I'm glad I kept the top. I'm glad I did the double green. <clears throat> it's gonna be a slugfest. Well, now they can't attack with that. Okay. Oh, fabricate. Not good for me. If they were smart, they'd put the plus one plus one on this uh, creature. Unless they want to put it on the Lyra. Oh no, you can't. Yeah, no. Okay. Okay. Sure.
Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. They need to be able to, d to kill this creature. But as long as this creature's on the board and I keep tapping a lot, I may end up... up and up we may and just we may just end up going higher and higher if i can get hmm, mm -hmm, i need a flyer i need a flyer badly they need to be the active they haven't gotten them they haven't gotten a, an island oh good they don't have an island which means i can't cast this Fantastic. Nice! Double strike! Woo! Attack. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yep. This can go, this is probably going to end up being very, very silly. Oh, good. Oh, they do have a blue now. Which means that they can activate that. Which really is going to help. Get it. Oh, I have another one now. Yeah! This is going to be able to block. Yep. And it has indestructible. So now they can't, they can't, oh yeah! Oh yeah! <laughs> now they can't attack with their Lyra! Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And then it, ooh, they can't attack! Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. Yep, yep. Yep. Five more. Five more, please. <sighs> I need stuff for travel. I need stuff for travel. <laughs> this is just gonna go infinite. <laughs> Unless they flange. I could flange. really high power so what did they just get? What? I can't tell what they just oh here it is. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Ah, ah. There's a chance I can get that card too. Who knows? Yep. They get a sapling. I get to draw. Um, yeah, I have to. Maybe I should get some double wood. Oh, yeah, trample. Yes. Okay. Combat. Attack. With these two. And... Uh, this one because it has an indestructible. <clears throat> they're gonna get life, but they're also gonna die. Yep, yep, yep. 
nice. <laughs> oh, nice. <clears throat> I hope that wasn't seen as trolling. And return. So they get another sapling. <clears throat> this game is hilarious. This game is so funny right now. This it still has been destructible. I can kill that. Um I could not do this. I could not yeah, let's play the mountain so that we have access to double uh, double grids. All right, this one, this one, currently don't have any turns at all, yeah, this one, there's something with travel, yeah, something with travel, yeah, yeah, this is gonna be good, <clears throat> they only have one flyer. I only have one flyer now. Uh huh. Uh huh. Get some double blue and double black out there. Oh no. Nope, was not cast from their hand. Ha ha! maybe bluff with this to just clear some stuff off the board. Oh, not a jungle. More saplings. Get some double blue out there. Oh, I can't do that. Oh well. Uh, combat. Travel double strike indestructible. Attack. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah. <clears throat> they should flange because they're going to die next turn. Oh, another one. Sweet. Okay, so this is going to block, no, blockers, this is going to block 
that has trampled. This will also block that one. Um, this nine is gonna block the seven. This five is gonna block this one. Wait, yes. No! This five is gonna block that five. This five is gonna block two. Eight will block this. And there we go. <clears throat> Now we do the thing. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Romeo again! First time winning. Ever. <laughs> 